Good morning or good afternoon, depending on where you are uh, situated on the planet. Uh, I want to thank you again for coming to visit my uh, channel. Uh, today we're going to be unboxing the 4K uh, sports camera. Um, the 4K sports camera I got on Taobao. Um, it registered up to about 295 yuan, 300 yuan, um, and took about six days for it to come here. Um, I was looking for a sports camera not as expensive as the GoPro, but would do similar things. Uh, this one boasts um, a remote control strap, which is quite cool. Uh, 16 megapixel camera quality, 4K resolution recording quality, as well as a uh, 30 meter depth um, waterproof case. Now here, I'm just going to take a look and open up the actual box itself so you can see what's inside. Um, when I actually got the box itself, as you saw from the previous picture, there was a very small dent in it, but nothing major. Um, but I have to say I was quite happy with the amount of accessories they gave. They kind of went OTT, but it's really good, especially for the price as well. Um, so you'll see inside here is about 15 different attachments I got. Um, inside here, uh, good old boxing. Um, and as you can see, the remote control there as well. So the first thing was actually working out how to get the battery out. So um, using a small latch at the bottom, you pull out the small battery. Um, the battery has a small pull tag on it. You get that out of them here. And a small lithium ion battery, uh, 3.7 uh, watts, and it has a three pin connector on the inside. Now it has an independent charger. You can charge it um, with the battery inside the actual camera, but you can charge it outside as well. Now just to get an idea of all the bits and pieces that come with it. So you've got the camera, the remote control, a spare bag for the waterproof casing, which is fantastic. The USB connection for the charger. Um, this buoyancy, um, I don't know what to call it, buoyancy bubble. So if you're going swimming and you lose it, it floats to the top. Um, some cushion cases um, to make sure you don't scratch your screen um, when it's in the case. Um, and straps, so many different straps. Um, straps and uh, clips for your bike, clips for the back so you can clip it onto your bag. Uh, ones with adhesives at the bottom. Uh, this clip specifically to clip onto your bag. The charger pack that I showed you earlier to charge across there. And then some more straps for your helmet. Obviously, there's a manual that gives a complete rundown of how to actually use it. Um, some cable ties, uh, another clip, uh, which helps gives you complete rotation of the camera. Um, adhesive, a lock, just in case you're in a country where people may be stealing cameras. Um, a few more rotational clips as well. Um, there's a micro SD reader. Um, this one didn't come with a micro SD card, but any basic card can work up to 64 gigabytes. Um, and the um, international charger that you can use in most uh, charging ports. So this is the picture of them outside the actual plastic itself so you can get a better view of all the pieces. And I use my portable charger here just to demonstrate to you exactly how the charging works. Um, so it takes about, according to the box, three hours for the actual um, charge to happen from zero to full charge. Um, there's a blue indicator light to show that there's power going to it. And then once you insert the battery, it changes to a red color, which you'll see here. And there it is. Uh, despite my fumbling, it's actually quite straightforward to use. Um, and uh, there was a part charge in there anyway, so it only took about an hour. But when I did a full charge the next day, it took about two, two and a half hours. One of the main reasons I bought this pack specifically off Taobao, the remote control, um, pretty straightforward. You have one button to take a single shot or a camera button to start recording or stop recording your video camera. I placed it on my right wrist and I have my, iPhone, my Apple Watch on my left, um, so it's quite cool. This is the micro SD card reader. Um, again, very straightforward. Works with any USB serial port. Um, I have a 16 gigabyte uh, USB, uh, sorry, um, SD card there, and uh, I use that one mainly in my camera, and it works fine. So this is the manual. Um, it comes in English and in Chinese. Uh, translation actually was very good, both grammatically and in terms of accuracy um, compared to the actual functions in the camera. Um, so going through it basically gives you the very straightforward instructions how to turn the camera on and off, uh, which the areas of the camera works for what, um, how to remove and install the battery, um, how to attach USBs, uh, micro SD cards, so on and so forth. Uh, one of the more interesting parts is exactly how you use some of those clips. So here's a picture of one of the clip combinations there with the actual camera and this is what it looks like actually in the end. I clip this one onto my bag 
and it worked quite well for me. Um, the only thing is that there's no anti-shake, so therefore my walking was a little bit problematic, but actually when I took that off um, and I put anti-shake on my videos, it worked quite well. So i um, very happy with the clip, and it never fell off once. This is the waterproof casing there, which is very robust, and it also has a second attachment on there also. So you have a full waterproof casing. You can attach that to your car mount. You can attach that to, um, let's say you're filming something specifically in static. You can, film, you can put it on there as well. Um, I can also put it in the corner of my kid's room to make sure she's doing homework and use the wireless connection via Wi-Fi, but I'll go into that later. This is the other connection as well, which gives you a bit of a swivel head. Um, this is, again, very good if you're placing it on your bike or if you're putting it on the top of your helmet and want to get different angles as you're riding if you're filming, uh, which I do. Uh, again, very good. Uh, over about 25 little pieces uh, that came as attachment to give you lots of variety, um, which is really, really cool. Also, in the booklet, it gave you options of exactly how much um, space you'll need on your memory card to film at different levels. You, you have 4K, you have 2.7, and it descends from there, and that can go up to 160 minutes all the way down to 30 minutes depending on the quality. Finally, there is a Wi-Fi uh, app that you can place on your phone that actually remotely controls the camera. Um, this is a function that can be used more for security, so you can actually put the camera outside your door um, or in another room if you're, say, wanting to watch the kids or something like that. Um, worked very well. The quality was almost uh, like for like in terms of the actual screen itself, so a definite plus for the actual camera. So. There's no real point of me actually doing a review without actually coming outside and testing the mic um, and seeing how it works. I'm currently in my neighborhood in uh, Shenyang. You can take a look around here. And uh, yeah, the, this is the footage from the outside. Um, overall, the clips and attachments for attaching it to my bag and to my wrist uh, have worked pretty well. They're quite strong and there's a few extras in the pack as well, which is amazing. Um, overall, very happy with it. Um, yeah. Uh, now I'm going to go film basically everything I can see. Um, thank you very much for watching, and um, hopefully I'll be able to have some tech in, if not next week, the week after. Again, please like, share, subscribe, um, leave your comments below if there's anything you'd like to see or any information you want about this one. Um, maybe you're happy to buy one. I'm happy to help you get one. Uh, just let me know, and I'll take it from there. Take care.